But something I never thought would happen. Boy, that guy is hauling ass. Well, good morning, everybody. Cruise man here. Just about to head home. It's a little cool today. Probably be a good day to do a moto vlog. Had to pull this buff down. Otherwise, I'm afraid it's gonna muffle my voice where you can't understand a thing I say. The temperature gauge says it's 55 degrees, but it's one of those days where it feels like it's 45 degrees. It's kind of cloudy and real humid. We've had a lot of rain and we're getting going to be getting even more rain in the next couple of days. So I figured I better do my motor vlog today while it's at least not raining it's still cloudy and kind of yucky out but what the heck so welcome to cruise man's motor vlogs if you're passionate about motorcycles you like motor vlogs product reviews motorcycle reviews you name it this is the place please don't forget to take a second to click that subscribe button down below and don't forget the notification bell so that YouTube will notify you when I come out with new videos. Got a few things to cover today. The first thing I want to talk about a little bit is social media. Uh, some of you, a lot of you, probably subscribe to this YouTube channel and you may follow me on Facebook as well you know we have two Facebook groups that I sponsor or that I administer I should say or that I admin one of them is just Honda Goldwing maintenance in general regardless of what year model you own the other is for the 2018 to 2023 Goldwing maintenance and it was originally started as a Facebook groups for people who owned my maintenance videos I was kind of thinking it would be a good way to communicate with people who had my videos that might have questions about the videos but it's kind of just turned into people helping each other with maintenance questions so check out those Facebook groups. I'll put links on the screen and in the description of this video. Also, I'm on Instagram and I don't have that many followers on Instagram right now. So if you're on Instagram, please follow me on Instagram. And believe it or not, something I never thought would happen. Boy, that guy is hauling ass. Something that I never thought I would do was I have reactivated my Twitter account. Now that uh, Elon Musk has purchased Twitter and I think he's taking it in the right direction, um, I have decided to reactivate my Twitter account. So if you're on Twitter, you can follow me at Cruise Man's Garage. And I will be starting to post more things there. So, Christmas is just right around the corner. I think I'm going to have to do my Christmas holiday season crown and comments here pretty soon. But since we're just a couple of weeks away from Christmas, I did want to take a second to remind you that if you're purchasing Christmas items that are motorcycle related, don't forget to check out my Amazon store. I never talk about my Amazon store, but I do have an Amazon store. And it does support this channel. So anytime you purchase anything from links on that uh, Amazon store, 
uh, it does help support the channel now it the prices are the same you would pay from Amazon anyway it's not like you're having to pay an extra fee and I have taken some of the products that I use that I like uh, that I believe in and that I feel good recommending that Amazon sells and I've put it in that Amazon store so I'll put a link to that as well and starting today last little bit of uh, new business starting today I have uh, started my holiday promotion for my Goldwing maintenance video series so if you own a Honda Goldwing 2001 to 2023 check out my maintenance videos you can save 20% by using promo code HOLIDAY when you check out. And this is the last opportunity this year to get that deal. So take advantage of that if you don't already own my maintenance videos. The link's in the description of this video because I have two different video series. One for the 2001 to 2017 model and another for the 2018 to 2023. I should have two or three more videos posted to my 2018 plus maintenance video series that deal specifically with the 2021 to 2023 Goldwing because there were some changes made and I had the opportunity this week to do some work on a 2021 Goldwing uh, by installing a very, very cool product that you are absolutely going to love. If you've got a 2021 to 2023 Goldwing, you're going to want to watch this video when it comes out because I'm going to show you how to install one of the coolest products that's not only cool looking, but I think it's going to enhance the safety of your motorcycle as well. So I also want to say a little shout out to my new friend Dennis, who allowed me to use his 2021 Goldwing for the installation. Thank you. <clears throat> and as a result, I will be adding some new videos to the uh, Goldwing maintenance video series just uh, keep an eye out for that it should be in the next uh, I'd say within the next week so lots of cool stuff happening I have another uh, product review that I'll be doing this week I'm working on it right now I'm hoping the weather would hold up so I could do some stuff outside with it I can't really use it in the rain and a lot of you asked me if I was gonna purchase that 2022 Goldwing that Honda sent me and I did consider it I did actually talk to my contact at Honda about it and they he said that they do sometimes they used to they don't anymore they don't right now because the supply is so low uh, they actually send those bikes to a dealer auction but uh, in you know back in the day when they had plenty of gold wings and plenty of motorcycles they would sometimes offer those to members of the media if they wanted to keep the bike and purchase it so I did consider it and some of you have asked me why don't I just buy the bigger trunk for the 2021 and later and replace the trunk on this 2018 with the larger trunk and that is something I'm looking into. It is a consideration. It is a possibility. The problem for me is that Honda does not make that trunk kit in white. So they don't make one to match the white Goldwing. Why, I don't know, but they don't. So that means I would have to have the trunk painted, which is an added expense. I think it's about $2,200 for the trunk kit, for the mounting kit and the, the painted trunk panels, but they only come in gray. And so I would have to have it painted to match this pearl white, which anybody that knows anything about painting 
uh, or automotive paint knows that pearl white, you know, a multi-coat pearl finish is the hardest, one of the hardest colors there is to match. It's, it's really a, a real pain. My friend Dale, who I've mentioned a couple of times, he's the one that had the climb glove issue. My friend Dale uh, actually was a paint and body manager for the Lexus dealer here in town for many years, and he knows everything there is to know about matching paint. And he had actually done it. He has a bike same color as mine, and he had actually done a couple of spray outs on uh, that that paint to match and uh, it's amazing the difference you can get with just a couple of changes like with clear coats and things like that but he is going to check on the possibility of getting those panels painted to match my bike and depending on what he finds out what the cost is and everything it's a possibility i might end up putting the larger trunk on this 2018 and how many of you would be interested in doing that on your bike? Is this something you would consider? Would you consider replacing your existing trunk? And it is a formidable task to do. It's not a simple thing, but it is doable. So thanks for watching. That's really it. Nothing major today. Uh, if you want a new crown and comments, uh, I, maybe I'll throw one together this week because I've got a lot of comments I want to go through. Got a lot of comments from you on the climb gloves. I got a lot of comments from you on the helmet review I did recently. <laughs> and uh, let me tell you, uh, I'm going to have to really, I may have to go buy a new bottle of crown before I do that crown and comments. So if you want one, let me know in the comments down below. And I look forward to seeing you soon again. I don't care what you ride. It doesn't matter what you ride. Just ride often, but ride safe. See you soon.